known Bill, obviously, for a very long time. Um, he was, I think, about the second treasurer that was uh, in the uh, in the committee, and um, we it, it was virtually a constant in the um, in the group for the well almost the whole of the uh, of Victorian government's history. Um, obviously, as you've seen up here before, we're just about reaching 25 years, and Bill's been around for 20, 21, 22 of those, 21 at least as treasurer, and. Um, has been a magnificent treasurer. It was a fantastic support for me through 12 or 13 years or whatever it was, and to um, Robin and um, Irene in subsequent years as well. Um, he was always keen to make sure that we kept our membership up. The membership was always, uh, you were never allowed to get outside the door without paying your membership, so he always reminded new people and old um, <coughs> that that was the case, and that he was always there to help. Um, Bill took on a lot of other roles, as Robin mentioned, not only just the, the general day-to-day -day running of the, of the Treasury, but uh, software sales, which is a massive thing in itself, um, drove him spare most of the time, and he, certainly in the early days until it sort of uh, has eased up a little bit in the last few years. The badges that were introduced were, uh, if my memory is right, was Bill's idea, and uh, he researched all of that and uh, sourced them. And uh, they've been a great hit for, for many years now. Um, the conferences, while they were organised by people within the committee, um, obviously there was a lot of money involved as well and there was a, a, a lot of organisation from a Treasury point of view. And once again, um, the man of the moment here was the, the man that it all fell back to in the, in the long run. Um, I also meant, forgot to mention uh, that it's good to have uh, Denise here today because uh, Denise has obviously had to... Uh, Put up with a lot over the over the years and been a great support to Bill throughout that time. We we certainly thank you too, Denise. Um, I think oh the other thing I was going to mention is that Frank Warren, who was the uh, the uh, auditor of, of our books for the last ten years or thereabouts, twelve. I can't really remember now. Quite a few. Um, has always been right from the very first year. He was very impressed with um, Bill's presentation of uh, of um, our books. And considering that, you know, he that was the first time he looked at a, um, a not-for-profit organisation and uh, wasn't sure just what he was getting himself into, he was very impressed and as a result has kept on going for the last 10 or 15 years. And um, in, now into his 80s, so uh, that, that says something about what Bill's done. Bill's always been a very dedicated um, member of the, of the group and um, I'm sure he'll be sorely missed over the uh, <coughs> next few years. I'm sure Doug will... Uh, um, has, has had a good grounding has, um, and uh, been shown the ropes over the last year or so to, uh, to be able to take over from him nice and smoothly. So, just in closing, Bill, I'd just like to uh, congratulate you on a fantastic uh, 20 odd year, 21 years. Um, you've been a fantastic help to the to GUM, and uh, I'm not too sure what we would have done without you, to be quite honest, and I uh, wish you well 